All right, guys, welcome back. In this video, we're going to take a little bit, bit of a break from the stuff we've been working on before. We're going to work on something a little bit more fun and flowy, and I'll get you ready for some of the more stylish moves that we're going to proceed to in the next part of our program. This is what we call the EB pass-through, meaning we're going to swing the rope to the side behind our back without actually jumping over the rope. Can it be done? We'll find out right now. So we've practiced the side swipes quite a while ago in the first part of the program. Bring the rope from side to side, we doubled it up, we got into that windmill drill, pretty awesome. It's really nice for a good warm up or maybe some of those days when you might be feeling a little funny in the knees or the ankles from something else. You still want to get a bit of cardio workout in but you don't want to do too much jumping. We can always accommodate that. So working from the side swipe, we're going to take the rope to the side four times. One, two, three, four, and then it's going to pass behind the body and come back over. It's not magic, it is completely and totally doable. One, two, three, four, and over and around. Okay? From the back, it looks like this. One, two, three, four, back and over. Again, one, two, three, four, and over. Doing it both sides. One, two, three, four, and over. All right, come back to the front. So, what you want to do is make sure that as you go right, left, right, left, I'm putting my left hand behind me and I'm going to rainbow my right hand over my head and bring it to the side to meet up with this. So just tip the, the handle. So the way this works is you do four side swipes. On the fourth, you're going to put your left hand behind your back and bring your right hand across in front of you in sort of a rainbow sort of pattern. Okay? One, two, three, left hand behind, right hand over, and that brings both ends of the handles to my right side, making it clear of my head and my legs, and then I can pull it back over and continue my side swipes. So let's do that again nice and slow. Ready? Right, left, right, left hand behind, right hand out to the side, and then pull it back through. Okay, let's do it without the pause. One, two, three, behind, over, and out. And again, I'll show you from behind so you can see what's going on with my arm. There we go. Right, left, right. Rope's coming over to my left side. My left hand comes behind as my right hand goes over, like you saw in the front, and then they meet together over here and pull to the side. Again, right, left, right. Left hand behind, right, and pull. Again, one, two, three, four, behind, and pull. All right, so you've done it that way. Let's try the other side. Let's go left, right, left, Right, right hand behind, left hand rainbows over, pulls to the side, and pulls through. Again, left, right, left, right, behind, and over. Let's try that one from the back. Left, right, left, right, behind, and over. Left, right, left, right, behind, and over. And it eventually turns into this. Behind, behind, behind. And you take out those extra side swipes. This is really good for opening up the shoulders, working on your external and internal rotation flexibility. It's also good for catching your ear sometimes. Just don't pull too hard. You just might have bend or holy field yourself there. Boom. Boom. And you can speed this up a little bit. Making sure that you keep that hand behind long enough so that the opposite side comes over and they meet together and then pull out. Otherwise, you're going to catch your ear like I'm probably going to do now. 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 Nope. I've got a pretty good flow going here. You can see it looks pretty cool. There you go. From the back. Here. It's a nice flowing exercise. Gets the shoulders warmed up. And again, if you're in between sets and you're just looking for ways to keep the body moving, keep the heart rate up while you're finishing out your jumping sets, this is a great way to do it. Okay guys, slow that one down if you need to, practice it over and over, and we'll definitely be incorporating that into the upcoming circuits in the next part of our program. Till then guys, have fun, and stay practicing.